Now, Form 1 admission for the last cohort of pupils who sat for the KCPE examinations in 2023 kicked off on Monday countrywide, an exercise that will see over 1.4 million learners admitted to secondary schools. Long queues were witnessed during the first day, but even as the Form 1 admission rush continues, thousands of children from underprivileged families risk missing out on their Form 1 places due to lack of school fees. Merian Nyambura has more. Day one of the week-long admission exercise and long queues were witnessed in various schools as more than 1.4 million learners began a new chapter in their education path. At the Regena Mixed Secondary School in Kisi County, Amos Ontario Form 1 student arrives at the school with her grandmother in tow. But unlike other students who were admitted to school with their personal belongings, Ontario came with the admission letter only. In the neighboring Nyamira County, admissions at the Nyamira Boys High School, Kebiringo and Kebabe Girls High School were seamless, as school heads admitted all students. However, some lacked bursaries to fund their education. 266. Almost 46%. The admission process at the Machakos Boys High School and Muruguru Girls High School in Machakos and Nyeri counties respectively continued without any hitch. Approximately 150 girls still going through the process. The first day, majority of the girls will have come, and our expectation is that uh, we will have received over 300 girls. Uh, about 400 students have reported, uh, which is within our expectation on day one. Um, we are expecting the full turnout before the end of the week but as a majority of the learners make the transition to form one many others remained at home due to lack of school fees simon Gitao, who scored 396 marks in the 2023 kcp exams is at a risk of missing his form one slot at the lenana boys high school and my family is not financially stable I have not reported to school since my parents cannot raise the school fees which is needed. Akikaa nyumbani ako na stress juu kama siku mbili tatu hakuli anaona kabisa atajua anaona hatuna uwezo so anaona hataenda shule. So yeye anaona sana anaweza chukua tanasa siku saa sipo shukula ni mtoto anaona hatuna matumaini. Gitao, who resides in Narok County, is frustrated and calling for well wishes to assist him fulfill his dream of becoming a lawyer. Mirianyambura, Citizen TV.